You know, for a walleye angler, one of the toughest decisions to make is if I'm going to go get a bunch of new rods, what rod should I get? And Bass Pro has really helped the angler out over the last few years with that walleye angler signature series line of rods. Now they've actually revamped that entire series of rods, and that's a series of rods that we have personally used for many, many years. And we had a lot of input on this new series, which is pretty cool. And the first thing that you'll notice is the color is different, right? It's a dark green instead of a black. But that's really minor details, I guess, when I'm looking at a rod. What I see here is with the spinning rods, and these are available all the way from five foot nine up to seven feet in length, but these rods in construction have what's called carbon coil technology. And basically what that's done is it's made all these rods stronger, and lighter. And when you're talking light, that's something that's very important because if I'm vertical jigging in a river with a half ounce jig all day long, it's nice to have a nice light rod in your hand. So there's those split handles here. There's actually a heat shrinked EVA grip on the spinning models too. Now as we look into the other techniques, they've also used that carbon coil technology, which is very, very good in both the bottom bouncer rod, which we have right here, you'll see it's a split grip as well. And this is a seven foot handheld bottom bouncer rod with that trigger right here, that trigger grip. And I'll use that for pulling slow death, pulling spinners on bottom bouncers, a lot of different things. But the first thing that I noticed when I grabbed this rod is just truly how light it is. And then we go up into the, to basically one of the most popular rods for walleyes, and that's your trolling setups. You'll see you have the telescoping models that you've always had in that walleye angler line. You have actually kind of the same style grip but what you have is added strength to the whole setup. So when you're looking at rods, it's just as easy to decide on what rod I need to go with if I'm a troller, a jigger, or a bottom bouncer fisherman.